In this video, we're going to look at how to deal with a coefficient as a fraction and applying the definition of the derivative. So if I want to calculate the derivative here, I'm going to take the limit as h goes to 0 of the function evaluated at x plus h. So it's going to be 1 half quantity x plus h squared minus 1 half x squared over h. So don't get intimidated by the coefficient here. It, treat it like any other constant. Right? So I'm going to take the limit as h goes to 0 of the 1 half times x squared plus 2xh plus h squared minus 1 half times x squared. Be very careful because you're going to make sure you need to distribute this negative to every term after every term in the function. This function only has one term, so it's not a huge deal, but that is something to be careful of if you have a multi-term function. So we're going to simplify the numerator, and on every single one of these, you will be able to simplify the numerator to cancel out all the terms that don't involve an h. I'm going to go ahead and distribute this 1 half to all the terms. I'm sorry. That x squared, that h squared should be inside the parentheses. So I have 1 half x squared plus xh plus 1 half h squared minus 1 half x squared. The minus 1 half x squared and the 1 half x squared cancel. So the limit as h goes to 0, I'm going to pull down h of these. I get x plus 1 half h all over h. If I pull out 1 h and then h squared, I'm left with an h. So I get the limit as h goes to 0 of x plus 1 half h. If h goes to 0, my answer here is just x. So the derivative of 1 half x squared is just x. 